A necessary condition to react to your environment is to be aware of it, and Vector has some tools at your disposal for that. At the bottom are the four cliff sensors at each corner that prevent it from rolling around the edge of the table. As with everything else Vector does, his reaction to reaching a limit. It has a gyroscope, which allows you to detect when it has been picked up or is holding it in your hand. The top and bottom are capacitive, so you can tell when you're touching it. A laser in the front can make basic distance measurements, but only up to one meter. The microphones allow you to hear the sound from any direction. It even has a kind of kinesthesis. You may feel when you move your robotic arm or head. But compared to your camera and what you can do with it, all those tools are primitive. Vector's tiny 720p camera and some highly intelligent machine learning techniques are the main way Vector understands the world around him. And understand much more than you imagine. The vision and robotics leader at Anki tells me that much of the computer vision work in Vector started with Cosmo, but now everything can be done locally. As Vector moves over its space, it creates a 3D map of its environment. It can detect and map obstacles, and its location persists for a short time in its memory, even after it has been turned around.